Hey, while Caitlin's here, are you uh, are you ovulating this morning? <laughs> what? what are well, you no, like, saying? Because uh, I think just by association, because last night she was near the baby. Do you know that our uh, former GM uh, is now a granddaddy, right? Uh, yes. Uh, uh, the daughter had uh, Tasha and Amit had their baby, uh, I guess, two nights ago. Yes, two nights ago at home. Yeah, at home. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. And like, at did home, she mean to or birth? It did she mean to or just planned that way? And she said it went fabulously and sounded awesome. And where do they live in Toronto? Yeah, they live in Toronto, in the okay. west end of the city. Yes. So you saw the baby last I night. I saw the baby last night. Uh-huh. She's adorable and perfect. Right, yeah. a little peanut. What Very did the doula healthy. do? What is a doula? What did the doula do? Did you find out about the doula? I don't know. They had two midwives and a doula, and I honestly don't know the difference. I'm Sorry, sure. Oh, I do. I do. I do. What's I do. You tell me. Well, we, we, we mentioned is. it on the show yesterday. Doula, a doula is just a person that's kind of like a coach that's with you. They, they have oh. no medical really background, okay. but they're there to assist. And midwives have. I could do that. Hey. Come on, let's see some action in there. Come on, push. And midwives are trained in birthing. If there's problems, you know, that they, they, they've been trained in that. So the doula is kind of like uh, mommy away from being mommy and uh. really knows everything there is to know, but really is not in there to uh, assist uh, as far as uh, medically. Now I see. Yeah. Do medical professionals approve of home births? Well, I think they, I, I don't know about that, but Nancy Duran was on yesterday. We can, we can call her this morning. She, she said to me that, you know, it's, it's, um, you should have a baby plan. And if something doesn't go right, you should be able to, you know, where your nearest hospital is and let your, you know, obstetrician know where you are or your gynecologist know where you're going to be. Right. In the event of, uh, complications. If there's a problem. Yeah. Yeah. More call and more people. Nine one and then yeah. push. And yeah. if you can't, then more and more people are doing one. this, but you know, but they have a plan and they have, like she had two midwives. That's Yeah. And, and the midwives major. are associated with a hospital. Yes. So you can have midwives and still give birth in hospital but she just chose to do it at home so if anything goes wrong the midwives do have a staff and a setup at a hospital and you can always go there well, yeah, but, yeah, have but that have a takes plan. time. I don't know if the doctor answers his question. I don't know if the doctors really like that. Though, yeah, that right? takes I don't know it, it takes time to get from your home to the hospital, regardless of where you live. If you're mm-hmm. in the hospital and you have a problem, you're there already, right? I I wanted to be there. I wanted yeah. to be right there in the hospital. To each his own, but I'm just yeah. wondering, you know. Well, there's some people just want to have the comfort of the home. No and the, kidding. What the risks know. are. Go to your own bed afterwards, or unless it's where she had it. I don't know, but, but you know, it's like you, just to be home. You, when you were at the hospital now, you know, That's it used to I be a two nights, mm, they, one they, night. They kick you out could now. be same day. Mm-hmm. Same day. My friend Rebecca, here, when she was living in town here, had twins. Right. So we went over with a gift basket uh, that same day. I think she had them at like uh, two or something in the morning. Uh-huh. So we went over the next morning to see the daddy and, and the other kid they already had and thought just take over some food because the, the daddy and the, the son would be starving. So we go over there and uh, this is about 11 a.m. Gently knock on the door and because uh, I figured how I'd be sleeping. Well, in the in Rebecca comes walking down the stairs. She's, she's Australian. Uh-huh. Hi, guys. I'm like, what are you doing? You just gave birth to twins. I was expecting like to uh-huh. fall apart as she's walking down the stairs. But this, I don't know if they build them different there in Auslyland, but uh, she's, she's crazy. Wow. Well, she, had, she had them at two and was home and, and walking down the stairs at 11 a.m. 